how do you do this? Uh, how we can connect with our hearts and like and, and th okay, okay, let's let's do something. So, so like it's it's not it's not difficult. The first thing you have to do is well, first sit down with your back straight in a comfortable position where you don't have distractions where you can connect with yourself and then the second thing you, you need to do is connect with your heartbeat and you can do this like feeling your pulse here in the neck or um in the wrist so if you follow the line of your thumb mm -hmm. down in the wrist like for example if you're um if you follow the line of your thumb here and you can find a small place here in the wrist you can feel your heartbeat there so try to find a comfortable position where you can lower your hands and still feel your heartbeat you can feel it with your thumb maybe sometimes you can even feel it here like next to the ear so there are different places so once you have found your heartbeat just close your eyes Take a, a few deep breaths. Okay. So now what you want to do is to bring all the parts of yourself that are outside of this time and space that is they're doing something else, bring them back to the here and now. Every single part of yourself that is not here now, bring it back. Just with your intention. Take deep breaths. Do this. And try to perceive, feel and perceive the space, the time between each one of your heartbeats. Feel the intensity of each beat, the velocity. The space between each beat. And then use your thought to notice the center of the earth there is a nucleus in the center of the earth so take your thought to that place you might see it in your mind you might feel it just know it's there and in the center of the earth there is also a heartbeat why because there is an electromagnetic body of the Earth that starts in the center of the Earth. And it is pulsating. So just take your thought there and use your intention to synchronize your heartbeat to this heartbeat of the center of the Earth. You will feel it. It will feel like a contention or like an information or just this warmth or something like a connection. And then take your mind to the center of the sun. Do the same process with the center of the sun. There is also a nucleus in the center of the sun. So think about that. Take your mind there. There is also an electromagnetic pulse. There is also a heartbeat there. So synchronize your heart with that heart of the sun. And try to feel and perceive it as you did with the center of the earth while maintaining your connection with the center of the earth at the same time. And you will feel
feel all three heartbeats as one. Heartbeat of the sun, of the earth, and your own. Here for about a minute. important thing is to feel you will feel joy you will feel peace you will feel connection not the thought process it's the feeling process that matters this will raise your frequency this is the technique It changes your body, it changes your biochemistry. The more you do this, the more it will change. I feel this very open right now. Yeah. Yes, it's always you can also you can also think about something or somebody that you really love or appreciate. And it can be uh, a human being or a plant or an animal or even a unicorn whatever you want just feel this emotion of gratitude and love towards this being and synchronize with these hearts you will st start to feel differently this is your inner technology you can change your brain states you can change your biochemistry at will you have this technology you're doing it right now Once you are in this aligned state, feeling your heartbeat, ask your heart, like if you, if you uh, could call your heart by, you know, by telephone and ask your heart a question, you can do the same thing as just ask your heart to show you a small incoherency in yourself, a small disorder. It can be a mental disorder, emotional, spiritual, physical, whatever. Not a big one, just a small one. Or something in your life that is out of coherence in your everyday life that you would like to order in this moment. Don't go to big things. Just stay with something small for now. And this thing that you need to order will appear as an image or a sensation or just a knowing. Once you have identified this disorder, ask your heart to tell you the cause, the root cause of this disorder. It can be even something that you don't imagine, but you will, you will perceive it. You have found it. Okay. And just trust whatever arises in this moment because you aren't in the line state, therefore your heart will tell you the answers, the correct answers. It never makes a mistake. So now that you have identified this disorder and the root cause, we will now proceed to order this, to harmonize, to align. So I want you to ask your heart to give you a geometry, a three-dimensional geometry, like, for example, a cube or a sphere or a pyramid or any geometry, symmetric geometry in three dimensions, even if you don't know the name. It can be a flower of life, a metatron's cube, whatever you want. And if you don't know the name, it's fine, as long as you can see it. Tell your heart to... Put a color on that geometry or a form of light and now tell your heart, ask your heart to give you a sound and put this sound inside of the geometry. 
can be any sound, it can be a music, it can be nature, it can be a human voice, whatever. It's the perfect sound that you need in this moment. Once you have this geometry with this color, with this sound, go inside of this geometry with this color and this sound, meditate inside of this formula, with the instruction to order to harmonize this disorder from its root cause. Just put the intention, like you probe, you can program this geometry with this light and the sound to order to harmonize this disorder that you have identified with its root with its root cause. And just stay in there for one or two minutes just observing don't try to do anything the geometry will work by itself and the sound and the light people say I've stopped receiving my heartbeat don't worry if that happens it's normal just stay connected breathe and just observe and feel what this geometry with the sound and and the light is doing to you don't have any expectations just observe It will work on you. You can have expectations, just don't be attached to a result. It will work on you. Okay, and now you can take a few breaths and just let this geometry stay there. I'm that is necessary. Keep on working on you. Take a few breaths and you can open your eyes and try to realize how you feel about this past disorder now. Does it feel the same? Has it changed or is it changing? Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, you, it's not like you're going to change everything with one single exercise like this, but it will change the disorder that, that you asked for. Because if you notice, whatever you asked, whatever you saw and you, uh, whatever you traced as a disorder and the root cause, and you ordered through this, it will change. And it has changed already. Maybe there's you know, another disorder and, and another cause, and, you know, there's a, a whole bunch of things. Okay, you, we have to work on each one. But this is, this is just a simple technique that I wanted to show you, you know, just to order one, one single thing. So we are, we are very precise with this, um, tracing something and the root cause and ordering this. And it will work on your system and, and you know, things will start changing. And obviously, it it's like we won't go into total coherence in one single in one single hour or whatever no okay so this is a path that you need we need to follow but every single day gets better <laughs> yes okay if, so if you have the discipline that's incredible this is like i mean if someone goes